In the Philippines, um, Cavinti was part of, uh, in Laguna. Our, anyone that came to Canada, they kind of uh, stayed connected together. So we would have these monthly family parties. And hence, me and Jun would just naturally grow up together. Um, we're not blood related, but definitely we call each other cousins. Yeah, I remember one time uh, we were bartending the family party and we had this moment at the bar, drinks were flowing, everyone was having a great time and we made a comment, we're like, what would it be if we uh, kind of ran our own bar or restaurant one day? And, you know, it's kind of surreal, here we are right now. Who knew that these two best friends would one day open up their own restaurant? While they say it's not an easy thing to do, it's their love for Filipino food and business that got them inspired as they manage Platito and also run their own full-time jobs. It's a real-life hustle. Uh, we had the same vision and we wanted to represent Filipino food. Um, in, uh, we wanted it to taste traditional, but we wanted it to be Contemporary, just a, a new take on Filipino food. Fresh, um, tastes good, and also we want everyone to have that experience coming here. The feedback we're getting from people that haven't had Filipino food before is that they like it. Positive. Yeah, it's a, a lot of positive feedback. A lot and of they them, like what they're, we're doing here. A lot of people come in here and they say, where's Filipino food been all these years? So we're just happy that uh, we're starting something. Well, San Miguel is one of the biggest uh, brands in the Lotus. Philippines. That's uh, Growing up, that was one of the main brands that we've known in the Philippines. Um, so it's great that we could get it here in Toronto. From prepping, dicing, and cooking, the kitchen staff rolled up their sleeves to get ready for a full busy day ahead. And the San Miguel beer and Cisic fries taste testing begins. Hi, would you be interested in, in trying today's pairing? Yes. We have San Miguel beer and the ever so delicious Cisic fries. Thank you so much. Yeah. So, so just to tell you a little bit more about uh, the pairing. So San Miguel is a pale pilsner. It's really light, super refreshing, really great for summer. And it's paired with the Cisic fries, um, which is just uh, like a a modern take on uh, Sisig, which is like really popular in the Philippines. Um, the San Miguel pairs really well with the fries. It kind of hits those citrus notes, cuts through the spiciness, and pairs really well with the crispiness of the fries. So Amazing. go ahead and enjoy. <laughs> So this is actually my first time trying Filipino food and it's really great because it has this sweetness with a little bit of saltiness and then you have that little kick with the, with the little hot peppers on top and it's the perfect combination. And then to wash it down with the San Miguel beer is perfect, nothing better. I will definitely do that. The fries just kind of gives it an extra flavor. And then right when I took a sip of San Miguel, everything just kind of got stepped up a notch. So it's really good. Very delish, uh, very um, refreshing and light. Mm. No, I like it, very flavorful. It has a nice kick to it. Yeah. Mm. Filipino poutine. That's right. <laughs> it's good. We encourage you to drink responsibly, but who is responsible for bringing San Miguel beer to Canada? Stay tuned after the break.